The Elizabeth School District officials saying they are not leaving any stone unturned when it comes to filling the more than 50 vacancies they have throughout the district. School officials actually held a job fair today. Fox 31's Aaliyah Sims explains how this is one way that they are looking to fill those open jobs. Yeah, Kim, district officials tell me about 60 people came out to this job fair today. 10 were even hired on the spot. Now, rural districts in general have difficulties with attracting and retaining staff, especially when nearby districts are able to pay more. So they hope by holding this fair and increasing pay, that will help fill the void. Elizabeth School District is taking a multi-layer approach when it comes to recruiting and retaining their teachers. Teaching in Metro RA is very different than teaching in rural Colorado. Dozens showed up to Saturday's job fair. Elizabeth School District Superintendent Dan Snowberger says part of the approach is not only thinking outside of the box, but also outside of the traditional pay scale. Our school funding formula is really outdated and, and rural school districts really aren't funded at the same level as our our metro district uh, colleagues and so the rural school districts have to do something different. The district recently changed their compensation system so no longer do teachers have to wait a year to get a small pay increase. To really empower teachers to earn based upon their contributions to their school, the district and their community. On the old teacher salary schedule, educators starting out would make around $40,000. On the new schedule, they can receive a minimum bump of $3,000. Looking at potentially substitute teaching. Sarah was one of the dozens of job seekers who came out Saturday morning. I thought it was a good opportunity for me to just kind of check out, um, you know, how I might be able to contribute to my community, kind of just see what uh, education looks like. Educators haven't had a particularly easy time finding teachers, but say the last few years have been more difficult than ever. Fewer and fewer educators and fewer and fewer young people going into the profession of education, so it's good to see the interest in knowing that we're we're, we're starting to be able to get to the point where it's not so hard to find educators anymore. Yeah, and all teachers in the district will get that $3,000 pay increase by the next school year. To view a full list of the vacancies, you can register and apply on Elizabeth School District's website. That link should be on the bottom of your screen. It's elizabethschooldistrict.org. Aaliyah Sims, Fox 31.